Hello there, and welcome to Build the Legendary Kit from the series Night Rider, issue 15. I'm oh, getting on with these. Uh, Just Doesn't Rust, one of my favourite episodes. We get Car, even though it does look like exactly like Kit in this episode. Um, so I'm going to be reading that later. Kit and Car. I just love, I love those episodes. They are absolutely brilliant. There's the instructions. Pass those. Uh, I will show those on the screen. So we're talking about car now. Car part one. So this is going to be excellent. I love car. I just love the evil. The thought of an evil version of kit. It's fantastic. And I wish I was building two of these. So I could build the car, ver car version. But it's never mind. Let's get on with this. Let's get started. We've only got a few bits in this one. Um, don't know how long it'll take. Probably not that long, but uh, here we go. Let's get on with it. So, step one. We need to take that off. Obviously, it wasn't attached to anything like that. But we need to take that piece, which is metal, and put it on there, basically. That's as simple as that. Yeah, and we need GM screws for that. So we need three GM screws for that one. Oh, get those. And we need our little trusty little oil bath. Which is almost dried out. I need to put some more in there. Fairly simple. Straightforward. As it should be. You should you should enjoy these builds. You should should be relaxing like like building Lego. Not as quite as easy as Lego, but it's uh, I have found this one quite re relaxing compared with the other builds I've done. I think I say that every every time I do a video. I know, I, I don't repeat myself. I'm getting old. What do you expect? So there we go. That's nice and tight on there. That's not coming off. Right, off. right so um, step two, we're getting this this part, I'm putting it in there like so, and putting an MM screw in there. Again, very simple. It's exactly what we did on the other side. And again, it is meant to be loose because it's your part of your uh, suspension. You've got the spring, it's part of your suspension. So, step three. We need these parts, these two parts here, they go together like so, and they fit. On there, and that is held together, make sure it's on properly, that's, that's held together with a CP screw. Just drop that in there. Doesn't need, um, doesn't really need oil on that one because it's, uh, is it being a CP? It's a plastic a screw for plastic. It's not a plastic screw, but uh, it's a screw for screwing in plastic. So you don't really need to 
tighten that as much. So there, that's on there. Lovely. Step number four, we have these two little pieces. And you can see those tiny little pieces there. And they just fit in here. Very tight, they've got to be very tight. There we go, that's one piece in. And the tiny, see, you, got, you did get some uh, tweezers the last time around. And this is probably why you got them because this is just as you can see that so tiny I can just see there's a tiny little hole there so step number five we're putting the spring on there and putting it in there, move that round. Putting it in there. There we go. That's in there. Step six is EM screws. I think it's that one and that one. I think. That's one in. Very simple. And that one in there. and tight yep there we go so for step seven we've got to turn it over again like we did last time and um we have an em screw there again to hold that in position but then we do have the GM that goes in from the side. It's there, just just there. You can see that. Uh, a lot more, a lot easier without the wheel on. To be honest with you, very, very much easier without the wheel on. So. All we've got to do with this issue is put the cap on there, and that is done. That is done. Thank you for watching. Until the next episode, the next issue, where we'll be putting the other wheel on. So look out for that one. I will say thank you for watching, and may the toys be with you.